guys it's JB at Stacks and Packs uh, doing a personal stadium club new release today 2021 second year they're doing this stadium club chrome you get one on card autograph it's hobby only this year chance at super fractors as well 14 packs a box six cards per pack good luck Danny G if you guys like my channel make sure you hit the like button Make sure you hit the uh, subscribe and the bell for notifications. I'm planning on going live a lot more. I know I've said that before, but believe me, I really am. I'm trying. All right, here we go. Oh, what's up, Zach? Yeah, they are, man. People underrate, like, they complain about Panini. It doesn't make any sense to me. I never get it. So you want to complain about... Like Optic of Baseball not having licensing. And I like Optic. But then, and, and most of their stuff is on card. The only autos that weren't on card this year, I believe, were vet autos. But like rookie autos are all on card. But then you get a box like this that's the same price or a little less than Optic, and it's a license, and the autos are on card. And people still complain. So I basically say just buy what you like and collect what you like. People want to whine about everything. Pretty much in this hobby or industry, people try to find something and whine about it. Oh, well, it doesn't hold value. Who cares, dude? It's like a little over a hundred dollars. Yeah, people don't understand that either. And then people want to uh, complain about sticker autos. You have to have sticker autos in the hobby. Otherwise, we would never have new products. So we'd be waiting for Mr. Douchebag over here to sign his autos that he's had sitting at his house for four years. So, people just don't understand that. Like, it's not easy like people think to get an athlete to come and sign like 20,000 cards. Stop whining about sticker autos. Lucky you even got an auto. Jazz Chiz home. Uh, we got a Garrett Whitlock rookie. Sean Murphy refractor. Christian Javier. Luis Patino. Mm, Stanton. Uh, Tanner. There's an Otani beam team. What's that more value for that cheap of a box? Oh, yeah, you definitely can. Jared Olivia, especially if you uh, split them up into like team lots or, uh, you know, you put like the parallel sets together. Or if you even got time to put the whole set together with like your ex extra cards left over. Uh, let's see. Daniel Lynch. Got an Aaron Judge throwback. What is that? Uh, Gary Sanchez. Johnny Bench with some balloons.
Trey Mancini. There's a Dahlback uh, rookie. Oh, there's another VR. Juan Soto. Let's go. Remember, these were these were loose boxes sent to me, so it could be from different cases. I don't know. Boom. Let's go. We got a Juan Soto. I, when I was watching breaks earlier, I didn't really see these cards get pulled. Virtual reality. Are any of these selling on uh, eBay? The VR. the first day but uh, oh here's a nice one key Brian Hayes throw back Tucker Davidson, Luen Diaz, Buster, Eloy Jimenez, Dow or Clemens. Got a throwback of Kershaw. Ooh, I think I got a yeah, we got a wave, baby. Let's go. A wave coming up. In gold, I think. Wave in gold, I believe. Uh let's see. Ha Song Kyom. We, what, another one? Manny Machado, VR Wave. It's weird. We got a gold rookie behind it. Ryan Weathers, Stadium Chrome Gold Rookie. Let's see what it is. 12 out of 50 in the Padres. Justin Williams, rookie. Oh, nice. Tati. Tati's beam team. The waves are not numbered. It's a sweet looking card though. We haven't got the auto yet, right? Yeah, we're still looking for the auto, too.
Trey Turner. Here's your auto. Got the base of Nick uh, Matone, and then you got a refractor rookie auto from the Phillies. Um, well, he's from Chatham, Illinois. That's not far from here. Then we got a Ty Cobb. Refractor. Pragmatics. The Garrett Cole beam team. DJ Peters. Chipper. Refractor. Oh, really? Nice. That'd be cool to hit. I like to hit, like I said, I like to hit one of those buyback autos, too. Or super fractor auto. It's a little tight. It's just a sleeve, but I got 55s coming. So they're so the little thicker ones won't be so uh, tight in there. The card's fine. It's just a sleeve. All right, we got a little more to go, and then Brian has the last two boxes. A oh, bow. You got a bow. Crystal Ball. You got another wave coming up too. Looks like maybe a beam team wave. Let's go. Ooh. Jared Kalinick, rookie. And on the back, a Shohei Otani. Throwback. Let's go. I bet you this is probably like... It's probably like a 20 or 25 dollar card right here. Maybe more. Two good boxes in a row. Let's go, son. Yeah, they did really good on them compared to last. Last year they were a little boring, but this year these are nice. It's a nice card right there. And then adding the throwbacks in there and the other inserts like the crystal ball set. They're sick. That's what I was saying. For like uh, 120, 125. Tops had them for like 99, but then with tax and shipping, they're like 115. <clears throat> tried to buy some more but it wouldn't let me through for some reason okay so that was for Mr. Danny G let's do a quick recap that was a good box I definitely like these cards a lot Beam Team, Fernando, Shohei Otani Beam Team, Throwback of Otani, 
Crystal Ball, Bo Bichette, Wave, Beam Team, Jared Clinic, Rookie, Virtual Reality, Manny Machado, Wave, Auto, Rookie, Nick Matone, uh, that's a Refractor, Gold, Ryan Weathers, uh, Rookie for the Padres, 12 out of 50, and then a Juan Soto, Virtual Reality. Pretty good box. Thank you, Danny G. That was one, three, seven, six, eight. Ryan Browns is up with the last two boxes. You're welcome. 